Hi everyone, my name is Jamie Henn and I'm the Strategy and Communications Director for 350.org and we are here in Bonn at the United Nations Climate Change Talks which are just wrapping up. You can see that negotiators are still stumbling around after a full week uh, of many late night negotiations. Our team was here to really meet with a lot of our partners around the world to prepare some big actions for the Paris Climate Talks that are coming up in less than a month away. First, kind of a report back on what's happening here in Bonn. Uh, it was a frustrating week for a lot of people. Uh, they came in with a text that was presented that was too short and left out key issues. It ballooned to over 88 pages and now they've shrunk it back down again. But there's still a lot of disagreement around the key elements. The two things that we're watching are the level of ambition, is there gonna be a strong long-term goal that sends a clear signal the world's moving away from fossil fuels? And uh, a way to really increase ambition, what, what people are calling a ratchet mechanism to really strengthen commitments as we go forward. The second really big area is fairness. Will there be enough finance for developing countries to help them make the transition? Will there be finance to help countries uh, deal with the impacts of climate change? More than tracking the negotiations, though, we've been talking with partners about what happens outside of these halls with all of you. Uh, there are huge preparations underway for a big march in Paris, the opening weekend of the talks, as well as actions around the world on November 28th and 29th, that first weekend. We're also preparing for a major action, the final day of the negotiations, where people will be taking escalated action, potential civil disobedience, to make sure that negotiators know that this movement is going forward no matter what, and to send a strong signal that we're ready to keep fossil fuels in the ground and transition to renewable energy. So. If you're watching this, no matter where you are, you can play a huge role in this movement by continuing to keep pressure up for a strong action in Paris and beyond. And if you're, you're in Europe or in Paris, get ready. Uh, there's gonna be big actions, big mobilizations, and we're gonna need your help there. Everyone here doesn't agree on much, uh, but they definitely agree that the only way we're gonna see progress is with a strong grassroots movement that can take on the power of the fossil fuel industry. We've seen how people here are talking about the divestment campaign and the impact it's already made we can do even more as we go forward to Paris and really keep this movement going. So thank you all so much. Uh, your work really resonates in these halls. Um, and as we know, change is gonna have to come back from the streets. So here's to a busy month in the build up to Paris. Uh, let's go get it done.